Hey guys, welcome to another little term review. Today I'm going to try the Scott and John's uh, by Cheating Gourmet. This one is the Shrimp Scampi Pasta Ball. Um, it looks good. If it looks anything like that, it will look good. Um, it is phosphate free and sustainable shrimp, 19 grams of protein, microwavable in minutes. It is tender shrimp, sweet tomatoes, and al dente linguine in a rich scampi sauce. 280 calories, keep frozen. Um, this meal is eight ounces or 227 grams. We bought these at Meyer. they were 4 dollars so I don't think that's too awfully bad. Um, like I said, 280 calories per bowl. And then there's other nutritional information. If you want it, you can use it. So, cooking directions. Um, cut a one inch slit in the film, microwave a high for two minutes, peel back film and stir. Um, microwave uncovered for an additional two minutes and let stand for one minute. Caution, it'll be very hot. So we're going to poke a hole in it basically, cut a little slit in it, microwave for two minutes, remove the film, stir it, and then additional two minutes uncovered. So that doesn't sound too awfully bad. I love sure I scampi, so I'm hoping this will be really good. Okay, it has four pieces, five pieces of pretty decent sized shrimp in there. So uh, I'm gonna get this in the microwave and I'll be back. All right, here it is out of the microwave. And um, you can see it's uh, quite steamy and hot. Um, it has lots of tomatoes in there. And so the shrimp and the pasta. There's not a lot of food here, but um, it smells very garlicky, very strong garlic. So it smells like uh, the shrimp scampi we used to have uh, ages ago. So I'm going to let this cool off a bit, um, pull some of the shrimp onto the top so it'll cool off, and uh, I'll be back once it's cooled off a bit. Hey, it's, I think it's had time enough to cool off. Um, I'm literally just going to get one whole piece of shrimp. So uh, there's only like four pieces in here, so it's still very hot. Stab that piece of shrimp. So here's the bite I'm going to attempt to take. Like I said, it's very garlicky. The shrimp smells really good too, though. Let me scooch you back a little bit. Love the flavor of that sauce. The sauce is really, really good. It's got a good, uh, you know, shrimp scampi sauce. It's it's um, got a good flavor. It's got a good texture on the shrimp. The shrimp is cooked really well. It's still got that chewiness from a, from the shrimp like you were used you're used to, and the linguine itself has a uh, a little bit of firmness to it, which I like. I don't like mushy pasta, so um, so this is really good. I don't really get the tomatoes. I mean, I know they're in here, um, but I don't really get the taste of the tomatoes, really. And um, where that the plastic seal was around the edge, this is gonna sound petty, but it made it sticky. So when you're touching anywhere around where that plastic seal was at, um, it's like got a glue, it's sticky. So just be careful not to touch it too much. Um, I wonder what it tastes like without any shrimp. It's still got that good um, garlicky flavor. Not as good as when you eat the piece of shrimp, but it's still pretty good. It's a little plainer. The pasta, now that I'm thinking about now that I tried a piece by itself, some of the pieces of pasta are a little hard. Um, they may have been where they were on top um, after I stirred it the first time. Um, and some of them are fairly tender, so. You no, know, like those were perfect. But I've got a few that were kind of hard. So I think it's a really good meal. Five dollars seems to be a little high for it, but it is. Um, let's see, I've eaten three. There's five pieces of shrimp in here, and there's a, some pasta, and then the tomatoes and stuff, and the sauce is really good. But there are five pieces of shrimp. I don't know how much shrimp can be cost. I have no clue. Um, but it seems like five dollars for frozen dinner. It's a little higher than some of them, um, which you don't see a lot of shrimp scampi in those little um, two or three dollar meals either. So. It is good. It is a really good meal. I like it. If you don't mind um, stinking up your office mates, um, office space, um, or the break room or the lunch room, you are going to make it smell kind of garlicky and fishy. So just warn you right now. Uh, if you want to chase them out of there for the day, make this. You won't have any problems with them the rest of the day. You won't have to look at them because they'll they'll come in and go oh and leave. Um, so it is a little fishy, but 
I think it's really, really good. Um, I'm going to give it, ignoring the price, just going by flavor and texture and stuff like that and quality, I'm going to give this a 5 out of 5. I really like it. I think uh, you would like it if you like shrimp scampi. Um, the amount of food's kind of small, but I still think it's a really good meal. I'm going to make a slight adjustment. Um, it ended up being six pieces of shrimp. One was like underneath another one. So there's six pieces of shrimp. So that's a good amount of shrimp. Um, I'm actually going to drop it down from a five to a four. I still think it's really, really good. But once you get down, if you don't, if you're not eating shrimp, basically, you're getting this um, really strong, like uh, just the tomatoey, no, it's not even tomatoey. It's just a really strong flavor that doesn't have that shrimp mixed with it, which is kind of strange. It's excellent when it has shrimp with it. But the pasta by itself with just the sauce, um, is a little strong and it, and it doesn't taste as good without the shrimp. So I'm gonna give it a four. Still think it's really, really good. Definitely worth buying um, to try out. It is five dollars, so just keep that in mind. But um, I still think you should try it out if you like shrimp scampi at all, and you want to chase your office mates out of your room. So I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.